What's up, guys? Vince Ruddy here. Welcome back to That Awkward Magic. And we're back. So pretty much uh, we're about to start this off. You know what? You know, the link in the description of the playlist. Do I remember? Do I not? The world will never know. But here I am reading it back again. That's, I still have a lot to go. <laughs> it's like the same effect with the Heartstopper. Even though I'm like almost like up to date with Heartstopper. Um, I had to be up to date with this, you know, just to get caught up. Just to know what's going on you know and um we're still in 2019 oh the simpler years anyways that awkward magic let's do this tap tap who who that tap tap oh hello Anzo, is that you in there Anzo? uh if my father discovered us i'm dead i can't move what's going on here jeez okay what is happening oh uh then we are so close that i can smell his shampoo how is it that we ended up in the closet again? Oh, ho, ho, I get it. Because, you know, anyways, get in there. My father can't know that I invited a guy over when no one else was home. What's wrong inviting a guy over? Like, <laughs> two dudes, you know, chilling. Totally nothing crazy. Okay, okay. But what about your eyes? What's with them? He didn't even notice. Can't he control anything? <laughs> I know, right? Uh oh, what's happening here? Why does he tremble so much? What what is happening? Hey, we don't have so much space for you to be moving like that. Yeah, what is happening? What is going on? What are you What are you doing? Hey, stop! You're rubbing. Oh 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 no! Ansel, stop moving. I'm sorry. I'm I'm very nervous. Nervous about what? What's going on here? Oh, feels anything? Oh no! Do you have a oh, Hey hey! <laughs> God. Shh! Do you want your dad to find us? Come down. Uh oh, uh oh. Don't be scared. I'm not a pervert. It's just that you are sitting on me and you move a lot. I just, I'm so sorry. Uh, just move away as much as you can. Uh, uh, oh, uh, whoa, whoa! This is not the time for that. Hey, guys, watching you. Okay, okay. Uh, what are you doing? Oh boy. Oh, hey, come down. No, oh, don't do that. Ans. Oh no! Oh no! Hey, this is not. Oh God! What? God, YouTube is gonna kill me. <laughs> Evan, hey! No, stop! Okay, <laughs> Evan, yes, Evan. Evan, are you okay? Oh, the eyes are gone. Okay. Whoa! Uh, gosh. Uh, what was that? The light bulb. It wasn't. Ta I wasn't talking about that. Then what? His eyes are normal again. Nothing. What's wrong with him? I dad left. What was my your dad doing at home? Uh, you must have forgotten something. He usually doesn't get home early. Lucky us. Yeah. It's a good thing he didn't see us. Oh, gosh. <laughs> Imagine. I would have uh, gotten in trouble. That, did his magic have anything to do with that? I'm sorry about this. It's just when he's mad, he doesn't listen. Oh. Well, hey, 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 calm down. What are you doing? Hey, wait, you put your sweater wrong. <laughs> really? Well, it was dark. Yeah, and a little tight. Right. Is it not obvious to the naked eye? Because this fabric is some peculiar. Um, Why are you looking at me like that? What? Oh, whoa. Oh, this is not the. Okay, I, well, if he left, that's good. Oh, wait, is this their first kiss? <gasps> Okay, part three. What? Huh? Huh? Hey? Hey? Uh-oh, where's this going? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Good. Uh-oh. Yes? Oh, calm down. Hey, cat, calm. Oh, wait. Whoa, where are we going? Where are we going? Come on. <laughs> Come on. I don't want to get any restricted. This is not... Guys, watch me. Hey, stop it. Ah, no, it's just... <laughs> stop it now. Oh, no. Oh, calm down. Everyone, calm down. Everybody, calm down now. <laughs> This is no resistance. Now, on the floor. <laughs> God, this I am so in trouble. Jeez. <laughs> you two be knocking on my door like, hey, we're we're going, we're coming in. What happened to you today? <laughs> I just had a fantasy with you and I couldn't resist. Oh, really? Mm, maybe my magic finally got you. Uh, yeah, maybe. What? Uh, did you uh see magic on me? What? No, I I, j I was just kidding. And how do you explain this? 
you were the one who kissed me. But how do you explain that I know, I, I, I now think of you in this way? Why am I blushing? That I have a sexy fantasies about you and that I smell your hair? Wait, what? <laughs> what? Hey, what? Where did I go? Oh, God, look at that. Uh, and I got angry when I saw you with Ellison's cousin. Sounds like you're in love with me. Oh! Sorry. I don't know why. Oh, God, this episode. Why? Me in love with you? Yes, that is not possible because you uh, and I are uh, okay that uh, haha, you see, Evan, if you like kissing me, then you like boys. Damn, it's normal to refuse the idea at the beginning. But could you consider it? Yes, in fact, I already did it. What? Wait, what? Seriously, you have you really thought about that since since when? Since I left your body full of hickeys, oh, uh, you, I had never acted like that. Why didn't you mention it to me? Because I am not sure how I feel, you know, actually, I know it's normal if you've never noticed a guy before. The problem is, uh, it's not that I didn't notice some guy before. I think is that I had never thought or wanted to do things like that with anyone before well i'm flattered i guess is not that i just don't think i'm gay also i recently met you a few days ago you were uh nobody in my life a few days ago god it feels like years let me tell you that no one really falls in love so quickly right and there he goes again aaron did yeah and you used your magic on me again with my magic uh oh, here it comes. You were the one who just one mo one moment ago told me that my magic had nothing to do with it. Yeah, but that was before you made me hallucinate in the closet. Stop it! I didn't use my magic. And feeling like this is not weird. Well, it is for me. Just admit you're gay already. Oh, man, this is getting real. Uh oh. Um, I'm so sorry. Oh. And why did I get angry like that? I'm just pushing him. I'm not like you. I don't drool every time a handsome guy gets in front of me. Evan, you're just in denial. You're the one in denial pressuring me on how I should feel. To ignore the fact that you don't know how to control your magic. I, a moment ago, you messed with my head. That wasn't nice. And you didn't even notice when it was very real to me. Hmm? Crap. That face. Don't. And what about you? What do you mean? You say you uh, don't mind that these things happen. Don't ask. Doesn't it uh, matter to you if it happens or not? Of course it matters. Don't harass me. Then what? You kiss me. You let me kiss you. Stop. Ew. And then you tell me you're not interested? Stop. How far do you plan to get with someone you don't... Enough! I'm trying all right. I've been waiting for you for more than a year, but it is a year. Uh, it is increasingly difficult for me to be near to you. Especially when you do things like these, which are things that I, I really want to happen. I know what I promised to you before. It's just, I thought I could handle it i'm sorry Ugh. fix this what would you do if you really if he really falls in love with you will you continue using him like that <laughs> so uh this affects you too huh it must be this weird connection that we have then we kiss and that's not really helpful actually you don't feel that way about me we are just some i wrote a letter what some what and what letter? Uh, we are just some... I don't know, letter. What? The anonymous letter. What are you talking about? Uh, I sent you that letter before you and Allison broke up. Huh? A deal? How do you know if it doesn't already like you, Jason? Uh, then I wasn't written by a girl and I just assumed it. I'm sorry. I know you and Allison argued because of that letter. That doesn't matter, right? Then, as you see, I'm not confused by any connection. I've known how I feel way before that. But 
about you and how you feel, you're probably right. I think so much of you. Don't say that. That that it's likely that I'm doing this to you without realizing it. What what's happening? No, because it is not possible for someone like you. Wait, I didn't say that. Or someone like Aaron to fall in love with you. Please stop making that face, especially if you carry half of me inside you. But don't. What? What's happening? What? What was that? It feels strange. Oh God, are you okay? This is bad. I feel a little like I I want to pounce on him. Pounce on what? Pounce? I'm sorry. I got you in this mess. I need to go. I guess I always knew. I don't uh, know why I asked you if I already knew the answer. Especially if it was something I didn't want to hear. Are you just leaving? Or see that expression? I was so selfish. I want to hug him. Evan, I'm going home. Hug him. What are you doing? I'm sorry I made you go through this. I shouldn't have ignored your feelings like that. At least uh, look him in the face. Ow. But don't worry. You don't have to pretend we're a couple anymore. Thanks for the favor anyway. If someone asks you, you can say that you broke up with me for being an idiot. Hey. What? <gasps> Grab. That's right. You thought you were about to leave. But you can't leave this feelings. You can't leave this feelings good. Wait. But don't. You are right. I think I'm in love with you. But if this is cause of your magic then, I don't know what I'm going to do with all of this. For both of our sakes, let's stay away a, a little, okay? What? Stay away a little? Door closes. He confessed to me. And also, he just rejected me. I'm confused! I don't know this! Ah! They're just kids. Part one. Hey, Papi Appa. What's up, Daddy Yo? Whoa. What the hell are you doing in this darkness? No answer, huh? I think I'm in love with you. For both our sakes, let's stay apart for a little while, okay? Then maybe you'll answer this, that what were uh, you doing inside the closet with a boy? Wait, no! He noticed? Are you kidding me? <laughs> what? Why are you making that face? Are you seriously surprised that I don't know I noticed you guys hiding? I was really obvious with all of your things in the living room. You even forgot to hide his shirt. You know what I think of your preference, and I don't want you to do those kind of things in my house. You can't take my trust and turn this into a br Stop that. It's not what you th you're thinking. He is my classmate, and he only came to do homework. And about his shirt, that was just an accident. Homework, huh? Yeah. Gosh, <laughs> there's no way of fooling him, let me tell you, from the looks of it. Then show me that homework you did. Um, that's what I thought. It is just a misunderstanding. If you, if what you say is true, look me in the eyes and tell me nothing happened between you and a boy, that boy. I wasn't born yesterday, Ansel. I was 17 too. Damn, lecture. Of course, I was never twisted like you. We're lucky your mother isn't here to see what you've become. Last year, I still hope you would change your mind about your weird tasters. Tasters? But now it seems there's no hope for you. No way to fix you. What? Bion? Blackout. Oh, now what? Huh? What a way to be welcomed back from work. Did, did I do that? Now I have to call an electricity company to complain. But that keeps getting worse and worse. Hey, where do you think you're going? Where's he going? Hey, to ignore the fact that you don't to don't uh, know how to control your magic. Sure, it was just a coincidence. Finally, here you are. Huh? What are you doing at the park at night? Hello? Uh, oh, are ya? How you doing? Do you know how hard it is to find you without using magic? What are you doing here? And where is your hat? I'm not on duty right now. Oh. Listen, about this morning, maybe I was very hard on you. It doesn't matter. Hmm? Hey, what's going on? Why the sad face? Did something bad happen? Are you? Oh, boy. 
Aw. Cheer him up, Arya. Can you make someone fall in love with magic? Of course, you already did. Of course. Are you asking because the boy who drank your potion by mistake? No worry if you broke the effect of the potion time. I'm not talking about him. I'm asking about someone who never drank the, a potion. Oh. No, you can't. I mean, don't without not without a love potion. Really? But I have heard that there are humans who are sensitive to magic. It attracts them a lot. So is it possible that someone uh, likes me just because of my magic? Oh, come on. Don't be so insecure. Is that what you're worried about? Don't be the people who perceive magic are very rare and unique cases. Like a boy with magic. Except... Oh. Hmm. I don't want my magic anymore. It has only caused me problems. You'll get used to it and then you won't be able to give magic up. Are you serious? Well, that's what they told me. Uh, is that what happened to you? Not yet. Arya, why did you get this punishment? Hmm? I told my boyfriend everything about my magic. What? Flashback. He said he loved me. When I proved it, he got scared and then he divulged in it. Uh, things got complicated and denied everything and we didn't stop fighting. The committee soon found out and forced me to wipe all of their memories related to the magic, including me. Is that what happens if the committee finds out you told anyone about magic? No, regularly they just get rid of you. Unless your magic is unusual and they decide to keep you, then they take ha away half of your magic and forbid you to have contact with mortals again. They assign you a punishment and when you are ready, you will be part of the committee. Oh, the committee? The ones that the... Uh, I don't know. We, we just went to the, the universe of the committee. It feels like years ago. Jeez. And you are unable to refuse that. That sounds horrible. Do all witches know that? Only those who receive a punishment and those who will disappear forever will know. Why do you think the magic gene is disappearing? Hmm? Hmm? Crap. Are ya? Huh? What happened to your boyfriend? Don't worry. It's forbidden uh, for witches to mess with mortals. So they left him alone after you wiped his memories? Yeah. But it was too late for him. He began to have panic attacks very often, and his family decided to put him in a mental hospital for a while. Jeez, what is... Is this boyfriend okay? Like, man, he's, we need to know about this boyfriend. Let me tell you, he's still there. And, oh, because I opened my mouth. They should have taken my memories, too. I don't want to be part of the committee. I miss my friends. I miss my life. Oh, boy. Huh? Oh. I had never said that out loud. Uh, maybe that's, uh, what I needed. I need to vent a little. Yeah, sure. Do you really plan to lead a life you don't want? Uh, to know your type of magic, huh? You asked me what the tests were for. There are five tests in total. What do you mean by kind of magic? If you have some kind of unique magic, you are chosen to be part of the committee in the future. And what happens if you don't pass the test? Uh, if uh, you are not in danger, uh, you'll be live a normal life. Well, normal, but with the benefits of magic. And what about the committee? They regulate the rules and offer judgments. They define what your magic type is depending on how you perform during your test. Sure, and about the... No, you won't be able to make portals. How do you know if I'm not special? Because you are very clumsy. That's why you won't pass the next test. Hopefully. Come on, I'll take you home. About your question of why we hide, I re answer the with the story of my boyfriend. Are you allowed to tell me about these things? It is forbidden to talk about it. I could get in trouble. Why did you decide to tell me then? Because... I would have liked if someone got in trouble for me by telling me this. That's all I'll say. 
do what you want with it. Interesting. Anyways, Anzo's letter, part three. What is this about? Ooh, oh my gosh. Let's see it. Oh, slant. Uh, don't do that. Hey. Hey, everything is going to be chaos. So, hey. Oh, poor thing. Uh, let's stop this for a moment, okay? By your face, I see that you already talked with Evan and things didn't go well. We broke up with me and we're not even really dating. Yeah, broke up, or, you know, basically confessed and broke up. I mean, what kind of mix is that? <laughs> I had so teenage life. How did I think I had a chance with him if I couldn't even keep a false relationship? Why did he broke up with you? You were right. I couldn't keep pretending that I didn't have feelings for him. He said I was too obvious. Did he tell you how he felt? He's not sure how he feels, so he asked me to stay away a little. Well, if it's not sure how he feels, maybe he's staying away for a little while. It's the right thing to do for him to think with clarity. I know, it's just that I shouldn't have pushed him like that. I'm very happy when I'm with him and I don't want to lose that. Am I being selfish? Are you okay? Oh, God. Oh, hey, hey, buddy. Hey. Shirt sure happens. Oh, I love that shirt. <laughs> it sure happens, all right. There is nothing wrong with a boy who cries in public of other boys. Hey, about today's conference, I wanted to know if you could answer some qu questions. Uh, something happened? Nope. What? Uh, Evan, if something is wrong, you can talk to me. Oh, boy. We are friends, right? Yeah, girl. Huh? What? You broke up? Uh-oh. I was prepared to give you a second chance if this happened, but now Anzo is my friend. I can't steal you away from him. Where will I draw inspiration to right now? Oh, boy. I knew it was you who did that. Not now, Evan. I'm trying to process this. <laughs> Why did you break up? Because uh, I'm not sure how I feel, I guess. Are you kidding? No, don't you notice the idiotic smile you have when you see him? What are you talking about? Don't you dare deny it. It's unfair that you shut us out of that way. You didn't give us a chance, and now you're not denying Anzo an opportunity. What do you think you are doing by testing each relationship you have just for a few days? I'm glad, Allison, that you have what you want clear in your head. But while I'm not sure how I feel, I don't want to waste Anzo's time like I did to you. Damn. So stop pushing me. What are you talking about? I didn't waste my time with you, you idiot. I have class now, and don't worry. I'll go to your cousin's conference. Evan Brooks, you're a cliche of insecurity. And when you notice it, it will be too late. Did you hear me? I fought for that relationship. Did she just call me cliche? <laughs> oh boy. That's the And hello, a letter. Evan, do you believe in love at first sight? Hmm? I'm writing this letter because there is no forcing, there's no force in the universe that gives me the courage to say this to your face. I like you. And I think I fell in love with you from the first day of school. But it took me a while to notice it. I noticed my eyes followed uh, uh, you whenever we walked past each other in the hallways. I noticed that I felt my heart beat strongly if your eyes met. But a weeks ago, I noticed a hole in my stomach when I found out that you had a girlfriend. I know it sounds silly, but I truly believe that we were destined to be together since I laid my eyes on you. I would like to know if you also felt the same or it was in my imagination. If ever my magic or by miracle. I have you in front of me and my legs. Don't let the fear of running away win. I'll talk to you, Anzo. I will approach you and give you my friendship. We'll talk. We'll text each other. We'll share secrets and we'll laugh together. And maybe one day. I'll confess to you and tell you that I like you. And it would be awesome if the day you told me you feel the same.
Thank you guys for watching. Hope you subscribe, like, comment, all the chats. That was beautiful. That was deep. But yeah, let's see if the relationship comes back. One love.